<sighs> Come on. I don't want to play this game. <laughs> well, you know what? Get over it. <laughs> well, as he said, we're playing Get Over It. I really don't want to play this game. You got this. I believe in you. What the fuck? Okay, uh, so let me get my boundaries. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Well. You got this. Okay, so I see why people ask. Oh, you had it. I feel like. Oh, see, messing up there is not an issue. Okay, now what? <laughs> hey. There's no feeling more intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute, if you won some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black, if you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately dropped food on it, if you won an argument with this a friend so and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view, starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, <laughs> like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away and come back. I'll be here. Don't tell me what to do. You're not my mom. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. Oh. I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Just find a safe place to stop and quit the game. And don't worry, I'll save your progress, always. Even your mistakes. Oh my god. There you go. Yeah, now. This game is a homage to a free game that came uh... out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of there we games. Go. And B-games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. Uh, they're oh no. the joy of building them than as polished products. Oh. In a certain oh, way, no. Sexy Hiking is the perfect embodiment of a B-game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts, and it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly <laughs> games of its time. <laughs> <laughs> in it, your task is simply is... to drag yourself up a mountain oh. with a hammer. And that act of climbing, in the digital world or in real life, has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor. No amount of forward progress is guaranteed. Some cliffs are too sheer or too slippery. And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of Slowly. falling and losing everything. Oh, really? This... I'm already getting annoyed with this. <laughs> <laughs> no. oh, he just lost a lot of progress. That's a Not deep as much frustration. As the first time I did. A real punch in the gut. I'm gonna punch you in your fucking gut if you don't stop speaking. <laughs> I would rage so hard at this game. Worse than Ibanob. Oh my god. That's a strong dude, though. Why is he in the cauldron, though? That makes no sense to me. I, I don't know, brother. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, suck in, and nope. <laughs> nope, 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 <laughs> nope. Sorry about that. Ah. <laughs> uh... Slow. <laughs> oh, skills, <excuse> mate. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. <sighs> oh, no. Fuck. Breathe. Breathe. <laughs> There's really no other boomers. This is really only it.
Do you need the coffee cup? Can you just go straight? Oh no, never mind. I see the rock. Oh, I'm a dumbass. Yeah. Anyway, when you start sexy hiking, you're standing you next to this dead tree that Fuck. blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree, and a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring the limits of your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them once you have the correct no. method, or the correct equipment, or just by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in sexy hiking is real. Yes. Easy, easy, easy there. I said easy. <laughs> this thing no. we call failure is not the falling down, but the staying no. down. Mary Pickford. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. There you go. Be like Mike. That was such a there you go. stupid joke. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Come on, smack the desk. You know you want to. Get mad. <laughs> Come on, hook smash it. Fuck! <laughs> <Nope. laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know why. <laughs> but that was hilarious. Pogo okay, die. There you go. Oh, oh. no, no, no. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. Now what you need to do is pogo stick real hard. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is... Who would play this game? Who tortures themselves this much? Uh, you do right now. The oh. Obstacles in sexy hiking are unyielding. And that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not oh. sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. How does this work? A funny thing happened to me the as lights. I was building this mountain. Oh. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle was my fault, as a player, rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts no. to climb them. Ooh. And it's our repeated attempts no. to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. When you're building a video game world, you're building with ideas. And that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with. <laughs> no. And in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. No. No. Oh. No. Oh. There you go. I had a boy. <laughs> you just having an aneurysm? <laughs> I'm having a fucking stroke, man. No! Okay. Firmly grasp it. Uh oh. <laughs> Firmly grasp it.
Gonna ask for a fucking refund on this game. <laughs> oh god. Oh my <laughs> Alright, it's clear that I'm not going anywhere. I'm ending this right here before I fucking like <laughs> commit mass genocide. If you guys want to see more, and I swear to god, I hope not. Like the video, subscribe if you're new, and please go gentle with me. This game's not being gentle. This game is not using lube for my tiny little ass. God. No, no, it's just... It, it, it's not. Also, if you guys like to see Pagboy here play this, leave a comment below. I will get the game you, for him. I will force him to play it. You don't want to see me play it. Oh, I absolutely fucking do. <laughs> you don't want to see You guys have a great night. Great day, great year, whatever. I'm out of this. Later. <laughs>